Hey guys, welcome to uh, behind the scenes of um, my Agrarian Skies 2. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot of stuff um, off camera, but I wanted to give a little tutorial on, I, I'm going to call it a tutorial, it's really a little what I did to make it work type thing. Um, so I'm going to, I, I, I'm obsessed with making sure I can craft everything. Um, that might be my new goal is I want to be able to craft everything. So. I want to be able to craft um, circuit boards, the printed logic circuits, right? So, because we have to use a lot of them. So, what I'm going to do is show you what I, uh, a way that I figured out how to set it up, um, and we'll, this will be a quick little video. So, the first thing we need to do is I want to, I already have one for, made for the logic board, I want to do one for the diamond. So we want to make sure it says processing pattern, not crafting pattern. I make a diamond, take a diamond in there and put that in there. So that's basically saying one diamond is going to give me one printed engineering circuit. Make the pattern and we have that. Okay. So now that we have that, we're going to go down to where I want this to actually be processed, which is going to be underground. Now this is going to be a little derpy setup. It's not going to be what will actually be here, but I'm using this as this is how I figured it out. Okay. First thing is if you put down your board and you put down, what do I need the engineering, right? Put it in there. So this is my inscriber. It's going to make it. It needs a diamond. I need to have some cabling going to it. So what I realized was if I like to use these um, these ME interfaces. Okay. So what I originally did is I said, okay, let me put this ME interface on here. I'm going to put this pattern to make the engineering circuit board in here. And now I'm going to connect it, right? So now we're connected. Boom. We're set up. In order for me to get it out of here, I need to actually import it into the system. And it has to be on the side. And we could bring this back here. And do I not have enough cables? Probably not. Let's just see. Will this connect? Yeah. So this should be set up, right? So this is originally what I did. So let's run upstairs real quick. And let's say I want you to print to craft me one of those. Okay, I need one diamond to craft one of those. Start. All right. So boom, da 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 da. What's going on? Nothing. And I was kind of confused. So see what's just sitting there. I realized it needs some power. So we'll run some power in there and look, now it's working. Boom, come in here, it gets sucked out the side and we're all good, it'll be up there. Okay, I didn't like that. So I'm like this, there has to be a better way, right? And just basically because I want to have four of these here and I don't want to have to have all that cabling. So where, what did I break? What am I doing? I need, where did it go? The interface. Oh, it's a flat one. Okay. So I want to make, I'm going to use this interface. And what I found is that with this interface, not that, with this interface, now it's connected there. I put my pattern back in there. This is still set up the same. Boom, boom, boom. Let's go check this out. Take that out, and now I'm going to craft another one. Next, start. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, boom, it's there. Okay, so five to ten seconds, it gets made. And what it does is it this is applying, uh, uh, giving it the power. So it actually, this will power this. 
so if if we use one of these things a bus I guess we can't we have to supply power from somewhere else so this is what I'm going to use as some kind of system like this where I'm going to have it go either on the ground here because I think I could just go straight across now um, yeah we'll have to see maybe I could put the I'll put the um, import buses out the front we'll figure it out either that or on the side but anyway quick and dirty this is how we're gonna get these things made and I will do another quick little um, how-to um, to actually make the, the board the full circuit board next so we'll make a, that will make the processor so the next step is to, to make the processor so there's my little how-to behind the scenes thing to make um, inscriber and my next one I'm going to do how to do the processor which will be much easier than this one all right thanks